गेट 2021 मेटलर्जी पेपर क्वेश्चन 45 द फिगर बिलो शोस द एंट्रोपी वर्सेस टेंपरेचर प्लॉट ऑफ अ रिवर्सिबल साइकिल ऑफ एन इंजन इफ T1 इक्वल टू 200 केल्विन T2 इज 600 केल्विन द एफिशिएंसी ऑफ द इंजन इन परसेंट वुड बी सो इन दिस क्वेश्चन they have not mentioned uh, which reversible cycle it is but if you look closely at the at the figure let me mark them 1 2 3 4 these are the four points so process 1 to 2 represents isentropic process at constant entropy s1 and temperature is increasing so it represent process 1 to 2 is isentropic compression likewise process 2 to 3 process 2 to 3 represents uh, isothermal heat addition isothermal heat addition at temperature t2 process 3 to 4 it is since it is a reversible cycle it is reversible adiabatic expansion or also known as isentropic expansion similarly process 4 to 1 is nothing but isothermal heat rejection which is at temperature t1 and this cycle represents carnot cycle so theoretical cycle some irreversibilities are always there in the processes so carnot cycle gives us a benchmark what about the maximum efficiency that we can get between two temperature limits now uh, since the another key term is the engine okay so the block diagram of an engine appears like this where the heat is supplied from a high temperature reservoir maintained at in in now problem it is maintained at temperature t2 the heat engine does some work converts the heat supplied to work and some part of the heat supplied is rejected to the low temperature sink or reservoir which is maintained in our problem at temperature t1 so in heat engine it receives heat energy from high temperature reservoir converts the heat energy to uh, useful work and some part of the heat supplied goes to the sink as a heat rejected so since it is coming from t2 i am going to write it as q2 and since it is going to t1 i am going to write it as q1 so coming on to the uh, yeah uh, from first law of thermodynamics tells us that energy is conserved so q2 will be nothing but w that is the useful work plus heat rejected that is q1 or useful work is nothing but q2 minus q1 also the efficiency is defined as the output energy in terms of energy by input energy it's a very layman uh, definition of efficiency now what is the output energy it is the useful work that is work output 
what is the input energy it is the heat supplied that is q2 since work output can be written in terms of q2 and q1 so it can be rearranged and can be written as q1 by q2 okay where q1 is the heat rejected and q2 represents the heat supplied okay so here the heat is supplied isothermally at temperature t2 and here the heat is rejected isothermally at temperature t1 means there is no temperature uh, change is observed during the heat transfer it is like a phase change operation which usually occurs at a like boiling and condensation which usually occurs at constant temperature but heat in, heat interaction is still there now coming on to the ts diagram here let me mark it 1 2 3 here from second law of thermodynamics the heat flowing in a process can be expressed as the area under the curve in a ts diagram so q1 will be nothing but area under the process 4 to 1 okay so q1 is t1 s2 minus s1 likewise q2 can be also expressed in terms of area so this will be the area under process 2 to 3 so area under process 2 to 3 is nothing but t2 again s2 minus s1 or also s3 minus s2 because because s3 is equal to s2 here the entropy is same during this process here also the entropy is same therefore the efficiency can be written as 1 minus q1 q1 is nothing but t1 s2 minus s1 upon q2 q2 is t2 s2 minus s1 so they will cancel out so we will get 1 minus efficiency in terms of temperature of reservoirs t1 upon t2 now from the problem t1 and t2 are given to be t1 is 200 kelvin and t2 is 600 kelvin since t1 is 200 kelvin and t2 is 600 kelvin therefore the efficiency of heat engine carnot heat engine will be 1 minus 200 upon 600 that will be 0.66 in terms of percentage it will be 66.6% so the correct answer the correct answer for this problem is 66.6% efficiency of this engine for more details about this concept of carnot cycle you can refer the npetel video lecture 5 applied thermodynamics for marine system professor p k das department of mechanical engineering आई टी खड़क